we're very thankful that uh, as people of faith, uh, which are certainly a significant and important part of the Democratic Party, uh, there also is the representation of the wonderfully broad expanse of faith traditions uh, that we celebrate in our country. And we're thankful that throughout the course of the week, uh, that that broad expanse will be very much a part of all of our activities. I'd like to remind you of a statement that the President made as he spoke in Osawatomie, Kansas this past December. He said, in America, we are greater together when everyone engages in fair play, everyone gets a fair shot, and everyone does their fair share. The context of understanding what it means to be greater together, I'd ask our panelists this morning to uh, give some reflection uh, to that idea, to that value, and the importance of it. And, and just as a note to Bene, I just want to make sure that we all remember that the full and complete argument uh, that was posed and waged around this concept was predicated, and I'm going to be very delicate in my language here, was predicated on a lie. <laughs> and that is that the president was grossly misquoted, and at the same time, again, we, we saw a significant head of steam get behind this concept of, of individualism, and I thank you all for your, uh, your response uh, to that. I, I'd like to shift now and, and, and take advantage of the kind of forum that we're in and, and ask a couple of questions that sort of really pertain to how we move forward in the specificity of being the Democratic Party. We've talked about the concept of getting together and how it's reflected in your faith traditions and obviously how we speak to those who push against that idea in some respects rhetorically and otherwise. Uh, but very specifically, in the context of who we are as a, as a party, how does this idea that, that's already been expressed quite well, but how does this make us stronger as a party? How does this distinguish us as a party? I, I think about the fact that oftentimes people will say, well, you know, there's no difference between uh, either the two parties or whoever it is that's running for president. So I, I'd really like to find out from you how this idea, this concept, this value of being greater together uh, distinguishes us as, as a party, and particularly so in the context of uh, this election that we find ourselves in. Let me ask you. And, and I treasure the fact, and I, and I say this without any, any hesitation, I genuinely believe that this kind of conversation, the expanse of what we've heard this morning, would not have taken place last week. That I'm going to be